LAPD commander is back on duty today after fighting coronavirus. He talked only to CBSN LA's Hermela Aragawi about what he went through and what he did to keep from spreading the virus to others. I just remember being exhausted. LAPD Commander Corey Palka is back on the job in full health after testing positive for COVID-19 last month. So when I was originally infected, we were in the very preliminary stages. Uh, there was some early discussion regarding uh, washing your hands. Uh, we had just started the language regarding safe distance. We weren't even, we were not even into the mask language at the time. Palka, a 34-year veteran of the department, says his symptoms were mild at first. With shortness of breath, exhaustion, slight fever, um, cough. The commander quickly got tested and went into isolation with his wife, Catherine. My adult college children uh, stayed with family and friends. Uh, and my wife cared for me. And uh, as a result, she was also presumed positive. Uh, based on some symptoms she had. Her symptoms were milder. She had a cough, some fatigue, and sore throat. Palka's fever briefly got worse. His exhaustion did too, but that stuck around longer, and so did the shortness of breath. The, the most anxious point was the delay in testing. Palka got his results nine days after his initial test. It created anxiety as far as who I may have infected, and I did not know. He was most worried about his elderly mother-in-law, but she is fine, and about a week later, so was he. Uh, I think I'm in relatively good health. I, I subscribe to a plant-based nutrition uh, that I've had for many years. I cycle and, and do many of the department's um, requirements or suggestions regarding maintaining a healthy lifestyle, and I feel that all of those contributed to uh, me coming out of this in, in a healthy way. Palka says he doesn't know where he got the virus from, but the department is still looking into that. About 40 LAPD officers have tested positive for COVID-19. The commander says he's in touch with about a dozen of them, and they are all doing fine. I'm Hermela Aragawi for KCAL 9 News.